Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is me again, Josie here. On today's video, I am going to do a little unboxing, so to say, type of video. It's not literally like an unboxing though. You know how I love TK Max, and I went there and I bought like a couple of gems. Hopefully, it is gems or these are gems, so to say. And even though I have not really tried so much of their product, I've been to their store, but then I am actually kind of in love of that store when I went there. And I'm going to give you a hint. Look at this. Can you remember one time I made a video of this item here when I went to Paris? So I will put you really really very close look at that can you read it can you read it <laughs> no okay it's Sephora it's product of Sephora I bought it at TK Maxx and I'm very excited to show it to you guys I have not tried it nor I have seen it like like so at the physical store or I have tried applying it I don't know why I'm so excited though but that is how I felt right now or I am feeling right now <clears throat> let me just drink some water first okay hold on a second I've been vlogging for the entire day so I have this water right in here so a couple of days ago I went to TK Maxx and I have no intention in shopping anyways but then it's like their magnet whenever I see them they wanted to um, yeah go with me and I think I could just not let go of them or couldn't hesitate <laughs> I couldn't <laughs> I could imagine well, my husband's looking at myself and then then I need to find some like a reason why did you bring another bunch of pack of makeup again what would you do with all of those things there's so many of it and <laughs> yeah most of the time I would say like they're saying hi hello Josie get me <laughs> bring me with you so that's what I'm feeling and by the way guys before we proceed with that so-called unboxing and of my first impression with it hopefully I'm so excited and I would be very happy also when I tried and opened it and um, okay now um, please do subscribe to my channel what I wanted to say please do subscribe to my channel like this video and click the notification bell so you will be updated whenever I uploaded new videos it's kind of like a very long intro already and now hello hello <laughs> let me tell you the story of this for those of you who have not seen the video um, of I'm going to link that either above or down or at the end of the screen so this is um, this is the Sephora penguin I kind of love it so much so when I went there I did not buy any Sephora product but instead I bought like Givenchy a lipstick and another lipstick and so as um, a, a makeup palette uh, from Lancome and then I wanted that to be because it is so special for me because that was the first time I went to Paris and Aww. it was summer during that time and yet I saw this um, souvenir and I thought like you need to get this so I thought of myself to be this <laughs> penguin <laughs> penguin going to Sephora store and bringing that Sephora bag with 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 her and yeah got some goodies in it and I find it really very funny and whenever I looked at it still I am mesmerizing the moment that I was in Paris it's very beautiful and I think that is a city which never sleep and uh, it's just fascinating and beautiful you need to like come and visit Paris if you are in Europe at least once in your life you should have seen Paris okay again I don't want to make it so long and let you be very, very excited. Let us start with the Sephora foundation. 
Now, as you know, uh, TK Maxx have like, I think, like items from different types of brands and sometimes um, most of the shades are just limited though. So I thought I will get this this um, the lightest shade that they had at the store during that time it is Sephora um, 10 hour wear perfection foundation it has no oil and it is a second skin technology I don't know the innovation in the information that they're putting in the product right now it's like very innovative <laughs> And then, oh, this is plastic, guys, and this is like modified glass. Look at that. Oh, look. This is the product. You see that? Ah, oh, this is looking very creamy. So, this beauty blender is already used from before. Look at that. I can't wait to like really try this item on my face and let's see if it is also performing on my face so this is the look of the product when I applied it on my um, at the back of my wrist second is this is for three euros in 99 cents and retails normally around 11 euros 10 euros in 99 cents i'm just rounding that off um and then it is a color scalp stick looks like a lipstick uh you could twist it and then let's see and this feels very very creamy guys and oh what is this zero one glare light bronzer contouring i don't really find it like a bronzer though i find it more likely like a contour i'm just trying it on my wrist but i think i'm liking it also next is this contouring of sephora for five euros in 99 cents and the regular price is 14 euros in 99 cents this is pretty small but i like it it's compact i like that because i could bring it anywhere and let's see and open it oh there's oh. so this there is this plastic cover I really thought that it's going to be creamy but instead it is actually looking powdery there is a mirror here and this is is a pink undertone this one is yellow undertone and this one is like uh, close to I don't know like a brown dark brown and this one is more like a bronzer let's see I wanted to try this one here oh looks actually good that here also and here very light um pretty decent almost like nothing but you could see the result of it though i could see it i'm not sure if you're seeing it in the camera because i have some um lights on the ring light on but it looks um, actually it looks like a powder contour palette next is we have some lip product it is pretty pretty uh, cute uh, look at that there's three of them it's in, in a black case and a retail price is five euros in 99 cents um, on sale for five euros in 99 cents and um, it is usually 12 euros in 99 cents and now three different types of shade this is um, lucky one 61 and zero two is courtesan and number 10 is what's up what's up <laughs> one is number 61 lucky one and then you know what I wanted to try this on my lip mm. The smell is, I'm not sure, it reminds me of those Avon product that I had way back in the Philippines. I'm 
there is a smell so this is number 61 lucky one and now i'm going to open the second one it's courtesan onto our lip also so i don't want to like put it all the way up because i know myself i'm going to break it it's creamy but it's not like glossy or uh, the texture of the balm no it's not like that you really need to have like a lip balm on your lip so it would feel soft also but it's not totally dry it's almost dry however again you could put some gloss and balm and i think i like it there's like different types of shade lastly guys we're going to try what's up what's up this one is really screaming red look at that so this is pretty red same smell as the other one <laughs> and they're pretty pretty small i don't like the smell i must say because it's not sm smelling so inviting <laughs> but the color is good and I think this is perfect for travel and I love that now I still have one more product and that is this um, Min Nature palette for 3 euros and 99 cents and the retail price is normally at 9 euros and 99 cents okay six different shades and um, let me see this is glittery and these ones are also have some glitters on but it's not that um intensive compared to the um this color that one and that one so let me read the the color this is cream candy almond honey chestnut and cassis this is pretty creamy and but you could see that the, there are fallouts using this this palette and I just wanted to pack it here I wanted to try this chestnut let's see this is pretty intensive and creamy I need to try this one without cleaning my brush though let me just see what happens if I'm going to try the Cassie's so this looks like that oh very decent i'll be using my finger to take this candy look at the candy candy this is so glittery guys and then we'll see if i will put that here you see that oh my god it's like looking pinkish a little bit as you try to swirl the brush on top of it I thought it's going to be like honey ah but it's like yellowish something I'm confused let's try this one so you see <laughs> I like it as a highlighter it looks very good and then let's try this one and mix this with here and put it here my goodness look at that this is the final result in so i got this plus the lipstick and the contour and so as the sephora foundation we are going to do a separate video for that guys just to see how it performs on the skin but um everything which i have got here i'm actually totally happy with it except for the lipstick because of the smell i don't like the smell of it it reminds me of those lipstick way back in the philippines and i think that was avon i'm not sure the color and the tint it's fine it's fabulous and uh, the size they're perfect for travel so maybe if you are going to have like a fruity flavor like something flowery or citrus fruity <laughs> then maybe uh, you will like the smell of it but then um, just the smell of it alone I 
I, I never liked it, okay? But the color, it was fine. Enough of it. And then this one um, is also pretty nice. Again, it's compact. I thought in the beginning it's creamy, but it's not. It's more on like a powder contour. And in my next video, I will be using all of this product to create an entire look and hopefully you are loving this video today if you do like this video guys please consider giving me a thumbs up share this video and don't forget to like this video did i just said that already below and click that notification bell for you to be updated whenever i upload new videos see you in my next vlog bye, -bye.